What about Roboa? It's controversial, but what about the how-to? When should we use it? When should we not? Roboa stands for Resuscitative Endovascular Balloon Occlusion of the Aorta, and it's increasingly used in trauma patients who are really getting sick and who are hypotensive. You can use it in two situations. If you have an intra-abdominal bleed, the Roboa is inserted to about 48 centimeters so that it occludes above the celiac artery. If you have a patient with a lower bleed, a pelvic bleed, it's inserted to zone three, which is below the renal arteries. You can inflate this balloon inside the aorta, but you're occluding all the circulation down below. So you can only leave this for about 30 to 60 minutes. This is an alternative to what's called resuscitative thoracotomy, where you're basically cutting the patient open and doing things on the inside. Yikes. Roboa is a technique that, again, recent studies have found uh, controversial and conflicting results about its benefit, but knowing when it's indicated and how it's performed, usually by a trauma surgeon or a vascular surgeon, but increasingly by emergency physicians, especially in a military setting, it has some utility and we need to know how it works and how to apply it. You can learn more on this on journalfeed.org. Just see the link down below. And if you want to sign up for our email list, just drop the word email into the comments if you're on Instagram and we will DM you so that you can sign up for the email list.